the shocks have changed. The governor of the central bank explains the impact of the openness of Iraqi banks on their international counterparts. Economy News, Baghdad on Monday, the governor of the central bank of Iraq, Ali al Alik, highlighted the impact of the openness of Iraqi banks on their international counterparts, while noting that the global economy has begun to face a phase characterized by rising levels of public and private debt. al Alik. In his speech at the conference, the challenges facing Iraqi banks in complying with international laws and legislation and meeting the requirements of correspondent banks, followed by Alictisad News, said, Central banks have faced increasing challenges after decades of appearances and are closer to quiescence starting with the decline in interest rates and inflation, pointing out that, the global economy has begun to face a phase characterized by rising levels of public and private debt. He added, the nature of local, international and historical shocks has changed due to an increase or decrease in demand, with the exception of supply shocks, in addition to new challenges represented by financial stability in public financial policy and the financial control decision that requires reducing spending or increasing domestic revenues. The governor of the central bank explained, over the past years, the Iraqi banking sector has opened up to local financial institutions over their international counterparts, and to the extent that all of this achieves communication and attention with the outside world, it undoubtedly carries many challenges and impacts. Ali al Alik continued, We hope that this conference will succeed in reaching effective solutions to this challenge and devoting cooperation and coordination between Arab central banks, Arab expenditures and non-banking financial institutions to achieve stability and growth. The conference will succeed in reaching effective solutions to this challenge and devoting cooperation and coordination between Arab central banks. Arab expenditures and non-banking financial institutions to achieve stability and growth.